Okay, we are live again. I don't know if anyone's here, but I'm pretty sure whoever I just left is either gone or still here. So I'm just gonna come and say that Microsoft, why are you dumb? <laughs> I'm sorry, why are you dumb? <laughs> like I knew it was coming. Me and Elodie already had a chat about it, but uh, yeah. Damn connection. Connection? No. Sorry. Let me get my words straight here. Damn automatic updates. Why do they exist? What's the point of having an update on a computer when it doesn't actually update? It just restarts your computer for no fucking reason. What's the point in that? There is no reason. And it will just schedule another one. Like, urgh. So yeah, that's what happened. I knew it was coming eventually, but... Bloop. I think that... I don't understand why it doesn't just, you know, not do it if you're already doing something. Like if something important is open, you know, like streaming. Ah, oh, god damn. Well, I'm back at least, so let's just get back into what we were doing. Well, we have to skip this scene anyway, because we've already seen it before. So, uh, welcome back to anybody who's actually still here. But yeah. Let's see if we can actually deal damage to this thing this time. Debatable if we can, but we'll see. Uh, Destroyer sounds good. Well, sounds rubbish, actually. Oh my god, that actually looks like we're doing some damage. Not much, but... Some. And he's still doing a bit of damage to us. Well, I can say we've definitely gotten stronger. But have we gotten strong enough is the true tell. Probably not, but we'll see. I think he just hits with physical attacks, so I don't even know why I did that. Uh, we're just going to go with Wave Cannon because it's bound to be stronger than Missile. Not very strong. Can we use a champion here? Mm, we probably could, but no. Well, I'm actually going to try and beat him. Like, if I use Libra on him, on him like, what is up? What is going on with this guy? Oh, he actually has things he's weak to. Holy. Electric and water. Well, he's full elemental resistance. I believe I still have holy. Holy, yeah. We'll see how much damage it really does to him, but probably not that much, to be honest with you. Unfortunate though it may be. Oh man, that was weak. This guy is just not going to go down easily. <sighs> like, he's still got, like, loads of health. Let's see this and how we can get... Maybe he's weak to physical attacks. He's not weak to physical attacks. Well, actually, we've done a decent amount of damage to him. I mean, I can actually see his HP bar go down. That's a plus. It would probably require a little bit more grinding, though. I can tell you that Berserk slash Haste thing ain't where it's at. Don't know how to charge that, but I kind of wish I could. I mean, he has weak to war. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, it's a little bit... Oh my god. Let's see this move. Holy shit. He's going massive mode. What the fuck? He's pissed. Holy hell. Yeah, he's not happy and we're probably dead right here. 
probably dead. We're alive. That was actually weaker than I thought it would be. You know, aside from the fact that we're almost dead. Oh, I'm not used to this. Right, we're gonna elixir it up, but I'm not sure it's even worth it. Whew. Nah, nah, we're gonna kick this guy down. We are going to. It's going to be happening to him. Sometimes it just be like that. Let's get everyone to full health and we can actually start. This is one of the times where I would I actually wish we had three party members instead of just two. So I'm basically just allowed to attack with one at this point, which is a little bit sad. Like, I'm gonna have to focus healing eventually. Yeah, let's mega ether it up. Like, if I knew if he was gonna do an attack, I might be able to do something different. Couldn't do this. Should be able to keep us alive a little bit longer. I mean, we are chipping away decently at his HP, but is it enough? Is the true story, true question here? Is it enough? I don't see my health. Is that at the top? Is that at the top? Of course, it's at the top. Why would it not be at the top? Okay, yeah, I'm seeing some results. Dude. Actually, bypasses defense, also stores defense all. Okay, okay, warrior, right, go. I think that the warrior of light here will actually be really good. Holy shit, and a critical. Oh, and a good timing. Thanks, Warrior Light. He's charging his super move. It didn't do that much. Although they're kind of losing their stack, but that's easily remedied by doing that. And in doing that. Random shock. Oh man, he's actually starting to hit hard. We don't have much elixirs, but we're going to burn through them. Ooh, we have the chance now to go and do an extra attack, but do we want to? Yes, we do. If this guy's really a super boss, then he's probably got something else hidden up his sleeve that we're not aware of yet. What that is, I don't know, but... Someone tells me I don't want to know. I can get high potions off because I don't want to waste all my elixirs. Okay. Some extra attack going off. I believe he's below half HP. That's about all I can say about that. I don't know if he actually is, but uh, I believe he is. No, he's about half HP, not below it or anything. A damn shame. You just heal up, mate. You just heal up. Why is he weak to electric, hey? Eh? Oh well. All right. No, you don't heal up, you attack. Use the other team to heal up, since they went through their burst already. Or not. Actually, that might not be a bad thing. Might not be a bad thing, because we have loads of them to burn. I'm talking loads. Don't know if I'd say it's a good thing, but... I don't know if it's necessarily a bad thing. Heal up. 
Alright. What did I just do? I pressed the wrong goddamn button, of course I did. Alright, actually, that wasn't so bad. Alright, if we can put Faith on here. Mega Aether, which I don't have, so I don't know why I, I was basing my entire strategy around the Mega Aether, Mega Aether, which I don't even have. My strategy isn't completely broken though, so fear not my Padawans. Fear not my Padawans! We're gonna just unleash this. Hopefully the Faith will have boosted its damage. Not by much, apparently. We don't have focus anymore, so yeah, we're just gonna go in with the holies. Oh, here we go. We're gonna be on low HP here. Well, maybe not actually. I think we've survived it with. Oh, yeah. Pretty low, actually. I believe we're pretty much elixired out. Pretty much. Probably should have bought more elixirs. That's fine. If I die, it shouldn't take my items away, right? Yeah, use your random shock. That random shock is really goddamn strong. I'm talking like super strong. Super action. We're just gonna have to heal up with these high potions. <laughs> it's not exactly optimal, but oh, it's not gonna work, is it? Oh, God damn it. Let's see, do we have any super strap we can use here? Don't think we do have a very good. No. Protect might help, but really, will it? I don't know. It's possible to beat them. We could probably stall them out, but maybe not on this goal. I mean, if he uses random shock, yeah, we're kind of fucked. I'm just gonna let him kill me. We're just basically slowing down our death at this point. Did really good though. Let's just use this. <laughs> See where we get with it. Not anywhere at all. Maybe I can use that to my advantage. Oh, maybe I can. Ha. Huh. You thought I gave up already? Ah, you silly rat. Silly rat. I don't give up that easily. It's just a tricky wee tactic, that's all. If I put shell on here, they might be able to survive some of the them damn attacks. Use Mega Phoenix. Next turn, it can get in with a holy. It's an amazing strategy. That isn't very amazing, but I'm going to call it amazing. Use that to boost our chances. Okay, now we've got this. You know, faith doesn't even increase it by that much. It's not worth using faith because that just wastes a turn. And actually, we can get away with using Warrior of Light again. Good idea. That'll bring him down a little bit, right? Alright, we're gonna kick his cat. Kick his cat. Oh, he didn't critical this time. But, still. Alright, he's nearly dead. I think we can do this. Yeah, I'm not scared, mate. Kinda. No, because we got resistance for some reason. And we've also got the defense up from the Warrior of Light. So it was a really good timing for that. Oh wow, don't even think that helped much, but... Still. Yeah, no, don't even worry about it. Just charge up. Just chip him away. He's almost dead. 
kinda hoping you would hit the other one, but okay. This is fine. Yes, yes. Use that like that. Let's get another shell stone just to make sure they don't take too much damage from random shock. Alright. Is it bad I'm using all this? Probably. Do I care? No. He's gonna die and that's all that matters. Okay, full output plus. No, not balance. Full output plus. Plus a holy. That should bring him down into a couple of turns of... <laughs> What's up, uh, Mega Man? You're goddamn lucky you didn't come at the start of this stream because it was kind of a waste. Thanks to Microsoft and their stupid auto updates that you can't turn off once they've decided to activate them. But uh, how you doing? We didn't do much, we just killed a couple of bosses for the story and then I got stuck so I decided, fuck it, I'll try this guy and now we've almost killed him. So I'm just going to burn through my items to kill him. So, there you go. Um, I ran out of elixir, so I'm kind of relying on using Mega Phoenixes to heal. It's a dumb strategy, but it's working, so clearly can't be that dumb. I mean, yeah, it's going to kill them now. And then they'll be dead, and then... I mean, look at how much Mega Phoenixes I got. Where the heck did I get them all from? I don't know. But they work. And because you revive before he gets a turn, you can stack and basically be fine. You'll lose, like, nothing from doing that. Oh, well, actually, that's a lie. you lose AP. If you have it stocked up. Oh, you did that too? Yeah, I did that a couple of days ago. Actually, I mainly did it yesterday. While also focusing on... Get my crafters and gather scripts, which I capped out in a few hours yesterday. And tried to get another stuff capped out, but I never managed it yet. Other than that, and that stupid thing that happened earlier t today, I'm fine. Oh, that's not good. It's not horrible, but it's not good either. But yeah, it's good, especially if you're crafting and gathering, to do that. Oh my god, he's actually... He's actually learning, guys. No, yes, yes. He's not learning. Come on, man, he's almost dead. Can we just launch a full attack on him? Like, what will water do? I'd laugh if water was what killed him. He'd be like, what are you doing? <laughs> uh, don't. Okay, come on. Water. Kill him, water. Kill him. <laughs> no. <laughs> I want the water to kill him. What about fire? Look at his HP bar. How's his... <laughs> He's dead, yes. We killed what I can only assume is a super boss, but probably not. I should didn't even give that much EXP. And it took, like, forever to kill him, but we killed him. Whew. That wasn't so bad after all. It's actually pretty funny. Apparently he's the strongest Cogna or whatever, and I'm just like, that's why I thought he was a super boss. I mean, if he's the strongest Ko Kafka. Kogna, then he must be the super boss, but I guess not. Alright, go to sleep so you can wake up and we can... Not craft! I know that you will probably craft though. Alexander. Damn Alexander. 
or Mega God Eld Box. A titanic humanoid Cogna, originally manifested in a world outside of Grimoire. True to its name, it's likely to be the last thing you ever see. Its abdomen looks like it wants to eat you. Oh my god, we act can actually name this thing. <sighs> well, you know the deal. It's time for someone to name this thing I'll probably never use because uh, I'm already leveling up an XL, which is Bahamut. Well, I suppose there ain't anything wrong with leveling two, actually. Hmm. I'll see. He's pretty big, though. Optimus Prime. Okay, it's gonna have to happen. Optimus Prime. Aww. Do you think Optimus will be fine? Optima. Because we can't finish the whole thing. I think Optimus will be fine. I don't know. I'll let you decide that one because you're the one naming them. Yeah. Sorry. Oh man, he's pissed. Wait, it actually kept us here. Usually it kicks you out. Did you want to cross the bridge again? Not particularly. That bridge was actually pretty annoying. Alright. Now I don't know what I'm doing. Because that was like the last thing I knew what to do with. My uh, quest marker is tell me to go into that black room and every time I go in there there's nothing there so why do you want me to go in there I mean we got all of the all of the missions done also I don't know how to leave do we have to actually go oh, no I don't want to get in a fight stupid enemies you'll die in one hit oh yep yeah, I'm not wrong Actually, that's no bad XP. You're not so stupid after all, enemies. Not so stupid after all. Okay, let's look on the map where we are. Oh, we're actually at the start. Okay, that's fine. It means I don't have to go up the entire bloody thing. That big bridge is not a lie. That light is that bridge is big. There's a region. We could probably find a teleport home with on here. But yeah, we got all the mega mirages. What do you want us to do, game? Maybe there's another one unlocked, we'll see. When we can finally leave. Which don't seem to be the case. How do you get on the mountain again? There we go. This thing looks like a spider and I love it. I know it's only got four legs, but I love it. What do you mean, finally a town? Uh... That didn't make any sense. Did anybody notice that? That don't make no sense with the story. What? Okay then. Uh. Oh, okay. That's alright. It was... Oh, I think this... Uh, it reset. I think it reset when uh, the stream decided to cut off. Uh, is that better? Oh, there we go. We'll see if that's better. Yeah, Um. so what just happened was we went next to that town and they talked about uh, it's controlled by Federation whatever. And then Tama spoke. Which doesn't make any sense because in the story Tama doesn't exist anymore or is dead or something. 
So how can she talk if she's not there anymore? What? That don't make no sense. Yeah, it's so weird. <laughs> Cause look, when we go here, well, it doesn't have the map, but if we go in here, also won't have the map. So never mind. But I need to go here anyway because I need to pick up the reward. Need, some need what something? Now? What now? Who's Bridges walls. Oh, that's that's your reward. <laughs> Resist accuracy. <laughs> Oh my god. What now? That's that's all of the interventions done. Every single one of them. Right, so if you go out here, it will tell you to go back in there. And I don't know why. See, it tells me to go back in there. But I done everything in there. And it's clearly not pointing to behind, because I'm behind. Stupid old game. Can't even keep to your own rules. Alright, I'll do what I've seen Aluria say, Balam Garden. Not exactly sure why we would need to go here, but it's as good a guess as any. Can we actually go back to there though? I like how this place is like forever locked down, like we'll never be able to go back there. Ever. Probably. Balam Garden. There we go. We have returned. Maybe we'll get a cutscene and they'll say, Thanks for coming back! No, because the fucking star keeps telling me to go now. Whatever. Let's Good luck. talk to everyone. Good luck. <sighs> oh man, she's not happy. Gotta do something. Hmm. I don't get now this part of the story. My research is going swimmingly. Yeah, whatever. Let's go up here and think this is how you get to the outside. And all that's here is this random guy. Make sure that you take a break now and then too. Yeah, make sure you tell me where I'm supposed to go. Alright guys, we're not going to beat this stream today because we're lost. <laughs> Am I supposed to have all of the Mega Mirages equipped or something? Let's see, does there anything here? No. Okay, post script, turn those corners up. Rain refuses to accept the cruel fate that has been visited upon her. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. A lot of this isn't really helping. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We did all that. Okay. I don't care about the backstory. Okay. Not in this time, I don't care about the backstory. <sighs> right, this is not helping us. Okay, so basically it's saying that I already know what I'm doing. But I already did that. I already did that game. What do you want? I already did it. Maybe these will lead onto us. 
because you got these from doing those big fates, so maybe. Maybe you need all of them, including Shiva and Ramu and Ifrit. Maybe. Save Tama. Tama's dead. I don't want to save her. Okay, so that didn't really help us. That's just, just giving us back so we already know. Hmm. I don't even know how to get Ramu. I know how to get Shiva and Ifrit, but I don't know how to get Ramu. Where's Pikachu's song when you need a... <laughs> okay. No, actually, you have to go for here, don't you? Yeah. Colosseum. I deliberately mis mispronounced that, so don't get on my case. Thanks, bye. We'll go catch Ifrit and see where we stand. Because he's like right there. Oh my god, actually, this is what you're supposed to do. So why did the game not point me to go here? Why did it point me to go to the other place? Once I was already done at the other place. Also, holy shit, look at these ones. I will never be getting them. I assume one of these will be Ramu. Ramu's Pride and Joy might be Ramu. I mean, it makes sense. Apart from the fact that it wouldn't make sense. Getting a bit, uh. Not fan here. Alright, let's just get Ifrit and then we'll work our way out from there. He's at the top. Okay, I'm a bit lost. Okay, there he is. He's in this one. Let's be we already have Shiva, so we don't have to worry about her. She's fine. She can do her own thing. So Sorry, Ifrit. We have to get you. Bomb fragment. There we go. Did zero damage, but that's fine. You'll be happy to know, guys, that you can't name... You cannot name these characters. They name themselves. Right. That wasn't so bad. Their name is Ifrit and Shiva. Yeah, I have a fire attack, I just used it. <laughs> wow, actually says that he's famous, even the laziest of the Final Fantasies. Because he shows up early in the story. Wow, no need to roar at my face. He does show up early in the story. Oh. Yeah. I suppose. Uh, now we gotta find Ramu. If we go down here, we might be able to find him. There's so many Colosseum fights to do though. I'll try that Ramule one. I'll try this one. Maybe he'll be in this one. Let's begin. Watch it. Well, I mean, not really, I guess. We already have her, so I'm not going to bother capturing her. But kind of confused. Actually, that would be kind of interesting because this is, as far as I know, the only game that's even mentioned this beast. I've never heard of a Ramule in any other Final Fantasy game. So I have no idea why they came up with it. But they did. Whoa, that 
they've changed what she looks like. What? Ah, I won't do much damage. Oh wow. <laughs> Did quite a lot to Ted's team. Team Ted. Destroyer. Hmm, if I give bravery to them, they might actually start doing really good. Yeah, because Berserk and Haste is a very good combo when combined with Bravery. Yeah, that's 1280. Really fast. Okay, that was a good idea, I think. That was a good idea, I think, anyway. Don't know if it actually was, but we'll see. Why am I speaking like that? Oh, we can't use that yet, so we'll just go with another attack. While Omega brings him down. Oh, they're not berserked anymore. Well, fine then. That lasts like barely anything. But when it does go off, it's pretty good. Uh oh. This wave actually is kind of strong. Especially on Team Not Ted. Why does it do so much to Team Ted? Mm, should probably think about healing. Maybe. I'll heal after this. Didn't Omega have a, like, a wee stat that made them take damage in Berserk mode? I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah, there they go. They are taking damage. Okay, Berserk is gone. Shit is... Shit is going bad. Okay. Let's see, we're just gonna not use the Berserk move anymore. We're just gonna wave cannon it up. Hopefully obliterate her before she even does anything. There we go. Easy cat. No trouble at all. I wish it got EXP from here though. Yeah, Thundaga seed's not bad. Well done. Well, that ought to do it. Do you not give any loot? Did that not give any loot aside from the Thundaga seed? I guess not. It was supposed to give you an X potion. Did it even give me it? Hmm. Unfortunate this is that I have no idea where you're supposed to find a Ramu. I'm glad the game is so helpful. Sort by complete first. Actually, incomplete first is easier for me. Oh, god damn. Uh, we're just gonna knock them all out, right? Knock them all out while I wait for something to pop in my brain, or maybe get lucky. It auto heals you every single time you leave, though, so. I guess we're doing this. So I think I'll fine. All right, this time we might actually try and catch one of these just to fill out our log. Try hide. Oh, it's a stack. That's not good. Well, if it's a stack, then we can't really do much until they're knocked down. Let's knock them down then. Oh my god, they got... They got Ted. I mean, Ted is just so goddamn strong. Mess! Stupido. Don't mess. Oh, you hit the wrong one. Actually, that's not so bad. Just kind of hoping I would knock you down. Knife! Oh, I won't do much. <laughs> I don't know why I felt that funny. Just mess. 
Oh my god, take this. <laughs> Try hide stack. Alright, let's see what we're gonna need to get a try hide. Because I'm pretty sure that's what we need from these guys. Okay, that oblivion thing is annoying. Can we remove that? Oh, remedy seems to work, but I don't want to just go with me a remedy if we can use something else. Remember. Oops. I don't know why it's called Oblivion, you could just call it Silence, like in every other game. You know, whatever, actually, Oblivion kind of... Stop making sense. Deal a lot of damage at once. Oh. That's not good. If I do a lot of damage, I'll end up killing the bloody thing. Don't believe me? Watch this. We heal that trihide on its own to maximum health. And then use a strong attack. Although maybe it's... We use missile. Let's see how missile goes. He died. Missile did not work. God damn Oblivion. Maybe it's scaled. Maybe an auto attack should be fine. Let's just kill the, the weaklings that we don't want. Haha. Uh -huh. yeah, if it's scaled, we might be fine. Good. We'll still have to heal him though. Feels weird healing an enemy with potions. But I'm doing it anyway. Yeah, let's see if this auto attack strategy works. Spoiler, that didn't work. Actually, I'm pretty sure that auto attack did more than the missile. Good job. I don't know. I have nothing. I got nothing. That's fine. I'm not exactly in a rush to get that thing. Well done. That was a good fight. I know, right? Bloody Tama. Okay, oh, we're gonna do Vampire Pedigree too. Let's begin. I won't beat the game because I then came where I'm going. I did what the game said. The game's like, yeah, you did what I said, but nah. I'll let you figure out where Ramu is. Because we won't put him with the other ones, even though in every other game he's usually with them. And even in this game, he's with them as well at the start. So I don't know what's going on with that. Much. Oh, and we also won't put a marker where he is. We'll just leave the marker to the place you've already bloody been. And have completed. Cause that's totally something that I wanted. Anyway, they seem to be pretty low on the stack. Oh, that's not very good. Well, I mean... If I do have them already, then that still doesn't answer the question of what the hell I'm supposed to do then. If I'm supposed to get all the seven things, the only one left that I am 100%... Well, the only one left that I'm not 100% sure I have is Ramu, so... I mean, I have the... Bahame, and I have the... Diablos and Leviathan and Odin and Ifrit and Shiva. So that would leave one more. Ramu. Oh ho. Oh ho. But at the end of the day, at least we get to clear some of these out. 
Even though there's like a gazillion of them. I don't think I will have them because for some reason it won't let me evolve my Ramule anymore than what it already is. But we'll see after this fight. I'll go look and see if I have a Ramu. I don't remember ever getting Ramu though. I have the Ramu line, but I don't have Ramu himself, I'm pretty sure. I can't remember of a time where I could have got him, and also, wow. Way to just pick on one guy, right? I'm not gonna waste a Mega Phoenix on that, because that's just a waste. Or is it? Because apparently that's a thing. Apparently being cruel is a thing. Why you be cruel? Okay. Gonna try and topple them stacks. Unless I kill them outright, then I suppose I don't need to worry about toppling nothing. Also, I like how a knife is kicking my ass as a robot. What the heck? Talk to Serefi about Tamo. Visit the tea room. It'll trigger a cutscene about having Tama by capturing a fox mirage. We visit Shantoto Zen. And Riffy will help you find the black fox in. Or share lot as in. Oh. Then why the fuck does the game mark appoint me into the girl's bloody tea room? Oh my god. Alright. Well at least I know where I'm going, so thanks. <laughs> Damn game in your unneeded unneeding crypt crypticism. Whatever. You know what I'm trying to say there. If I got XP, I'd probably revive them, but at the end of the day, you don't get XP, so what's the bloody point? You just kill them with what you have. No trouble at all. No trouble at all. Accuracy plus plus. Plus plus. Oh, oh. So I actually have to use Tama. I don't like the idea of that. Forcing you to use certain mirages Come back soon. at some point. Also, why does the marker here show, like, my main story here or something, when my main story is not even here? So, come back soon. I don't think it's... Mm, I don't understand why it shows you that main story is there. It doesn't even, like, show you which one the main story is supposed to be under, it just says all. Oh, Figure it out from like the gazillion that are here. Okay, let's go to this inn. I like this region. I don't even remember this region. What the heck did we even do in this part? Or that part? I do remember there and I do remember here. I don't remember this part. Whatever. Maybe that's where that stupid train part was. Okay. So now it shows it here. Oh, that's great. Weird old game. Who the hell would guess to come here? Well, I suppose maybe I said it in the text. I'm not gonna say I might say it in the text. I wasn't really Hello. looking. Hello again. What's up? Not been here in it ages since like the start of the game. Well, that's creepy. You're here about the black fox. Wait, what do you mean? Hmm. Black Fox. I knew the woman who was killed. She was... my aunt. Huh? What? Huh? Wait, if she's your aunt, she's gotta be. She has to be. Yes, that's correct. She was Uncle Taka, I mean, the Thane of Saronia. Uh, I don't know. This Hang game's on. weird. If that's a coincidence, it really is creepy. Tell me. 
Why do you need to find that black box? You want um, pretty sure no. But she does have an uncle. I believe that's her uncle. No, I'm pretty sure actually it's her father. I can't remember. I never paid attention because there ain't much story, character -y things in that game. It kind of just goes by. I don't remember her having any other relatives. Let's not forget, I'm going to. Oh, of course. Goes without saying. Mm-hmm. That's more like it. Okay. Tea. Well, you be careful. No sugar tea. Actually, it does have sugar in it, but it's really cold. Oh, don't tell LM tea. I know, I know. Just get going. However, I don't think Sherlock is from any other games, so. That's alright, there's a cat up there. There's a cat down here as well. Where are we supposed to go? I didn't really read what she said. Oh, there we go. I did so, it right. Uh, where is this black box <laughs> hiding out? It should be an icicle ridge. There's a path separate from the one that leads to the harbor. It's a little harder to find. Well, why don't I go on ahead? See you at the entrance. Where are they? Damn. That's not my business. That's Dragon Emi and Ellen's business. I'll leave that shit to them. I don't I don't deal with the plants. I can't plant. I'm not a plant man. I just need a I'm just gonna ask a question. Is the stream laggy a bit at all or is it fine? The reason why I asked is because I upped the bitrate a bit. And also, it seems that my uh, computer CPU is getting a little bit high there. It's fine, okay. I remember this side path and wonder how to get because the thing was here on the map the entire time. Dude, I never would have found this. I wonder if we could go here, like, back in... Like when you first come here? Mm, maybe. Then you'd probably get your ass kicked, but still. I'm ready when you are. Oh please. Okay, these guys are not even gonna last like a second. They're probably gonna give us like nothing oh, EXP. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I wish enemies this low you would not encounter, or have at least have the option to not encounter, because it's just annoying. It doesn't give you anything. Alrighty. This is the place where he lost her. Yeah, I wonder if we could come here yeah! at the start. What the? It's coming from over there. Hurry! Coming from over there, hurry! Oh wow. Don't take on the fox with spikes. Why? That mirage. Why do I load it with every fiber of my being? If you were my uncle Taka, then of course you would despise that mirage. Hmm? Is that Refia? Well, I thought her uncle wasn't actually a soldier. I'm confused. <laughs> Once again, I feel the pull of destiny. Boy, am I really not glad to see you. Tell me, Refia. Why is it natural? I would hate that thing. You can tell me first. Who am I really talking this to? Is, I, I, I just can't actually remember the start of this game, so... But this flesh I inherit belonged to the human you so lovingly called Taka. His body? Then you've possessed him? So, then, where is he? Dead for quite some time now. <gasps> Monster! Is that what you consider honor? Oh no. Those are the rules of this world. The human body is a weakness. The door most yeah, I'm pretty sure Taka was the blacksmith. But this game kind of has its own differences. It's weird. 
Why do I bear such incredible enmity for that mirage? That guy who's because you don't use diversion. Him, his wife was killed by that mirage. If you look at that fox and feel hatred for it, it means his memory. No, his soul still lives on inside of you. That's absurd. No trace of him could remain. And yet, the hatred inside of me. It is this is the one Bahamut soldier who's who's going to join your team. He'll be at the end of the fight. He'll be the final boss, helping you. No, not really. Oh, I see another twist of fate. Yes, of course. And your arrival is one of the resulting cakes. I see it. Fascinating. Let us test this vortex. And see just how fast it holds. Oh, Troy was coming to attack me there. Uh oh. Good we fish. Let that karmic kook find the black fox and kill it. Won't that ruin all of our chances? Oh, let's go after him, Rain. Called to the risk. <laughs> that could be a thing that could happen. Why did I say that? I have no idea why I said that. Why does it have to be a straight path? I'm not playing Crash Bandicoot. Oh shit, I thought you were actually talking about the fish as well. Right, let's do this. Here we go. Bloody Sid. Sid ain't coming to no rescue. He's done, like he won't appear in the game anymore. He's he's out. He's out of commission. Hi Freya, how you doing? <laughs> uh, yeah, I suppose they are cute, I suppose. <laughs> I guess that's why they do it design that way, yeah. The best is the frog, of course, because Ted is awesome. But we're near the end of this game, so this might be the last day you see me play this one. Not sure. Yeah, I like frogs as well, until I confuse them with toads. Because they're about the same. This the culprit we're after I thought we were supposed well, to. It does look exactly like Tama does in her more regal form. A bit confusing, right. but whatever. There was that guy him. ran away here and then Let's he just kind of disappeared, I suppose. Lives. For now, forget about imprisoning it. You should focus. It's unprisonable. It has no weaknesses, even though I thought Holy would actually work. Um, blind apparently. It can be blinded. Ah, whatever. I wonder if it's like, like it gets stronger the more times you kill it. I know, right? Seraph's voice is so weird. That's how Seraphi sounds. Seraphi 9980, that's how she sounds in real life. I'm joking. I don't know how she sounds in real life. And that's not an insult because we are. Uh, oh, what's that word that people like to use? Friends, I suppose. <laughs> don't worry. Not, not, not trying to knock anyone. I mean, considering the fact that I have a weird voice as well. I don't want to blow everything on this because I feel like it'll just be a waste so actually let's see how this goes again because this seemed like a good strategy when I got going 1998 damn it one one less damage and we'd have been the same yourself sport 998 is close though How much health do they have? Yeah, that's deleting it. It's deleting it. I love that strategy so much. I hope it actually doesn't have extra lights because I kind of don't want to deal with this thing too long. <laughs> just because it's a random boss. And if you wonder why I'm just attacking, it's because he's 
close to dying so didn't want to waste my AP in case there was an extra form but it doesn't seem like there was because she's apparently dead okay then that's uh, alright I suppose if only I could use hello world I will soon Way to something far worse. That's Uncle Taka. What he would feel. This this guy's so weird. <laughs> My uncle would never hurt anyone, not even a fly. And he never tried to take revenge for my aunt. No matter how much you hate someone. There is an upgrade to Omega, but you have to be level 90, and I'm like level 60 odd. Like I'm not gonna be able to take that guy out. So. Empty. So this is how it feels to be human. Guardian down. If it's like Tama, we have to assume this thing has got nine lives. Well, now it's got eight. How many does it have left? No wonder the thing wouldn't die, no matter how many times I killed it. Yes, thank you, Bahamut soldier. You made it that we didn't have to fight this thing eight times. <laughs> Must contain the black fox's lives. If you can hear that cat, nice. um, sorry, she's always like that. I don't know why she always meowing to get inside my room whenever I close the door. Must expire. It's down to two lives. That's all you left it with. You must have had a grueling fight. And yet I had nothing to show for my great struggle. Nothing at all. Now it seems. This is the old. Are we supposed to feel like, oh no, the soldier's dying? One favor. To see this man is buried alongside his beloved wife. <laughs> okay. Apparently, we are. <laughs> Melly, shut up. Oh, there you go. That will keep her shut up. Nah, Jen's crying right now. I could tell you that one. I'm choking. I don't know if she actually is. Did Refia leave already? Yeah. They're going to hold a proper funeral in Seronia. Gotcha. Well, Refia's a strong girl. She's gonna be. Uh, anyway, we actually have to go fight the final boss soon. So. You going yeah. Wars? Like I told you, it's very simple. Cats get around. That's good because it means I meet my goal. Of beating this game today and then beating Sonic tomorrow. Whether people will be interested in the Sonic one, I don't know, so but might as well finish it, right? Nine Hills and bring that girl the QB lives we got, like the bad mom bombs we are. Sounds good. I'm not a mum bomb. I'm a boy. How can I be a mum bomb? I have to be a dad bomb. That heals, yeah. But where am I going? Finally. Shadowbringers prep tomorrow. If I made a stream about Shadowbringers prep, I wouldn't have anything to do. I'm pretty much prepped already. Oh no. Did we botch up the job? Hmm. It's a little unorthodox. But this could work. What do you mean? She has morphos in her hair. We'll use one to spin a new thread. Oh, I don't even I don't even give a shit about that challenge log thing. I'll do it for crafters and gatherers, but I won't do it for battle classes. Cool. At least I won't actively work. I mean, let's be honest, right? You'll get the dungeon one when you're doing the story anyway, so who the fuck cares about getting that one done instantly? It's a lot to explain, not to mention the long ritual. And since time is going to change... But you're not really getting it early because you'll be getting it at the same time anyway. And the main story will get you to 71 before the first dungeon anyway, so you don't even have to worry about that. That's only a problem with alt jobs. So I don't see the point, really. Hello, I mean, I suppose it's good for Gunbreaker and Dancer, maybe, but... No! 
Tama's back. Uh, ow, I hit my head against the wall. <laughs> I've got loads of stuff to do in 14. I'm never running out of stuff to do. Also, I've passed the time pretty well, I'd say. Uh, I wanted to clear it away, but you see how that happened. I tried soloing. Whatever it's called. Heaven or high, but that didn't go very well. <laughs> it's a bit too hard for me. And I don't really have the effort to actually try anymore. Oh, the key. <laughs> Claim your reward from the menu's adventure log. I don't know what I did, but cool. Oh, the key! Let's do it then, I suppose. <laughs> Wait, that was a mini quest? We actually needed to do it. So why was it a mini quest? Tamo Mahime, if I actually used Tamo, that we could actually use that. Alright then. No, I'm not using Tamo. I'd have to grind our levels up. Fuck that. I ain't dying that. There's Tamo and Seraphi. Oh my god. No. <laughs> Why are you telling us to go in here again? <laughs> Please actually have something for me. Of course you don't. What now? Who's so it won't be hard, but it actually costs time. Oh, actually, we do have something to do in here. Okay, then. Suppose we actually have to do this. This is the final boss, guys. <laughs> Not really. Wait, you actually have to digivolve time. Like you don't even have a choice. That can't be right. Seraphy, were you looking for me? Huh? Oh no, no. Since we're both pixies, I thought, hey, I may as well ask her about transfiguration. Hmm? Transfig? Why no? Now that oh my god. Thomas I don't want to do that. Oh well. -like. I can't help I'll see where it bit. stands and then I'll go. More like, really, it's just a pang. Just a smidge of micro envy. Just a smidge, huh? <laughs> Siren has weird floaty hands on her hoop. It looks weird. Toe. Like, she has wings. High level mirages. I'm not sure I'm cut out for it. Non combatant and all that. <laughs> huh? Key. Do you want to help her out? Key. Oh my god, that should be how I talk. <laughs> that hurts. How's this? Maybe we three can help you out a smidge. Three? Really? There's only two. Oh, that's sweet. Uh, I did not mean to channel Ron just now. Hmm? There's only two. Wait a sec. Oh, three. damn it. I was hoping it was a mistake. Now, Siren, call in a high level no, you're not supposed to prove me wrong. Mega Siren. I guess that means oh. when is on oh, it's to just normal Siren. She definitely knows what's up. But how the come I have to work my butt off just to help Seraphy? That doesn't seem right at the all. Well, just pretend you're helping us collect Mirage. Diva Seraphy. That's his name. What name? Diva Seraphy. Diva Seraphy. I like wave cannon because it looks like a cannon that's like a wave. So that's why wave cannon is my favorite cat. Thanks for watching my talk. Go pet dogs. Not silent voice. Ah. Uh... Wolf, whoa, do you see our fucking eyes? 
key as pest. Thank god actually I'm not really using abilities much. Um is there like a bravery version of that? No. No. Don't say like it. Don't seem like that's gonna be a uh, thing we can do. Why are you doing it again? She'll get look. Look at them fucking eyes. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know why you need to do it twice in a row, but yeah. Three times in a row. Come on, it's not even It's no funny anymore. Are you nearly dead? I think she's nearly dead. Oh, damn it. I wanted you to use it four times in a row. Why did you use haste on the turn where you were going to die? Why would you even think that was a good idea? 65 is a decent level. I'll probably take the eye out and then replace it with Tama then if I need to do that. I hate that, that thing's face. It's too basic. Like it doesn't... This has got one expression and it doesn't move. Not so fast. The only reason you won just now is because Lon and Rain were there to help you out. Huh? What? They can do that? Oh, I sure thought I would need Ramu. You must have sensed them there. By your side? Hmm. I don't know what's going on, but the important thing here is that I won. I couldn't find it pretty much in the Colosseum. Oh, you have to manually select his battle when you have all of the summon rages. I can't see most Rappu appear for the final battle. Okay. Alright then. Maybe he hasn't appeared yet. Maybe he's appeared now. I mean, if he's gonna appear any time, it'll be now, right? I'm pretty sure that's all that he's done. Alright, well... Let's go get Tama. I don't even know a good place to level her up. If we even need to. We'll see. Actually, we'll replace it with that. Sorry guys who wanted this person. Tama's right at the top. She's level 33, so she's already decently leveled. Does she have any AP? Oh, not much. Just 7. However, her board is filled. Does that count? Does that count? I'm pretty sure that counts. That must count right. It's got to count. Do I actually have to level her up any more than that? Probably not. Although I assume I do actually have to transfigure. There you go. I finally got it right. I didn't get it right at all. Alright, so you say talk to her with our evolved. I saw a girl here the other day looking for you two. I didn't recognize her, but she was all anyway. She said you two have been given the power to Oh, but uh so I'm guessing that she says that, like, ages away. Alright, let's get Ramu, and then we'll see what we actually have to do. Ramu will be the last one that we need. Uh, oops, wrong button. Colosia. Imagine you had to do every single side quest in the game to beat the game. That would be horrible. 
because then it wouldn't be side quests, would they? Oh, don't they hank so? Don't they hank they would be side quests? Yes. Yes, what is it? Do you have ears? No. Okay. Okay, let's see if we've unlocked them. I see no Ramus. Well, that's there, it's new I suppose, but it's not a Ramu. Unless I already did Ramu and then maybe he's like somewhere. I'll go through them all to one that looks like Ramu. Oh my god. I have completed 57 or more side quests. Not any Shadowbringers, but I have completed them. Yeah, and if I go through over these, one of them will be Ramu. I'm not holding out hope though. Most of them are just bloody remakes. Ramu, where are you? Like, Ramul is there, but Ramu's not. Ramu doesn't even exist! How are you supposed to fight Ramu if Ramu don't exist? Who thought this was a good idea? I like how this game is so like normal right until the end and it starts just being randomly confusing for no good reason. <laughs> oh, go find Ramu in the Colosseum, but he won't actually be there because be we decided he's not going to be here. What does that mean? Go through the list is manually selecting the fight. I don't care what that means. I'm pretty sure how you got Shiva and Ramu, uh, Shiva and Ifrit to start once uh, was when I clicked on one of the penguins that randomly put me in that fight. So I think that's what it meant by that one being automatic. Whereas it won't actually do that if it's the Ramu. That's what I took that as. I don't know if that's true, but I mean, manually selecting the fight, I would think, would mean clicking on the fight, not, I don't know, whatever. We'll see after this battle if there's something I missed. Also, what the hell kind of stack is a dragon with a Tornberry and a Cacti? Yeah, you think you want to kill me, but you don't. Yeah, I think you want it, but you don't. Alright, don't worry. You killed a cactar. That's all that matters. Alright. Let's see if there's something I missed, because... Things being a bit dumb. I mean, well, I've done that one, X Tefs of whatever, whatever. And do you want proof? Uh, I've done that. But it unlocked the three level 55 fights. Okay, so... Is this by level? No. By level, okay. So let's go up to 55 and see what we're missing here. Oh, we don't even have any level 55 fights. Okay, well, you know what, let's have a benefit doubt. Let's go let's in begin. here again then and see what's going on. Nothing up here there, but we'll see. Shut up. If we just kill this guy. Might be a little bit tougher than on what we expected, but maybe I missed something and killed him too early. I don't know. 
Leg sweep. What are you? A dragoon? Never went leg sweep to damage. Gala farmer members. Gala farmer members! Why am I just all attacking them? Auto attack. Auto attack. If I'm gonna auto attack them, might as well do it with some style. And by style, I mean like this. <laughs> How do you not kill him and complete that all? That, that don't make no sense. Okay, we'll try. Maybe he ran away. Maybe he pet a cat. Who knows? Yeah, that's the only instance I remember that happening though, so... Yeah. I do remember beat, well, at least challenging this guy. So that's why I'm confused. Okay, well, we beat them, so... Let's, uh... Let's just see. Well done. Well done, you did it again. Alright, so... Sort by level. And let's see... It didn't seem to make a difference. Alright, so when in doubt, we're just gonna do all of them. All the ones that we can do. Maybe eventually we'll trigger it. Maybe eventually we won't. Uh, the only way I can think of to know is to just do it. Okay, we'll do this one because this one's level 37 and we can just knock it out. At the end of the day, all we're doing is just clearing more of them out to give us more completion, I suppose. They didn't last long. They didn't last long. how you have to do this every time. There was another easier one down here. Yeah, the tortoise was pretty easy. We'll do the tortoise. Praying man toys. Let's begin. <laughs> it was a joke and that's why they say that because it was a joke. Do your work. I'm oh, actually I want to catch this thing. Flick defense down. Okay, guess we're not catching this thing. I didn't even check to see what he was weak to. I assume ice, but I don't have any ice attacks. Rembalor. Oh my god, he's weak. Oh my god, he's actually kind of strong. <laughs> We'll see if the Berserk will change hit my perception. Oh wow. That actually hit pretty hard. Yeah, I know it's a critical, but still. Fighting this guy at level would be a bitch. What am I gonna hate? Oh my god, no. I think I have a reason what- I think I know what you're gonna say. I have a feeling I know what you're gonna say. I- I don't want to say it because... But... We'll see. Randomly after catching them, but I've already caught them. So does that mean I have to catch them again? That seems pretty dumb. Okay, let's see if that's true. Let's begin. 
Oh, no. I know what you mean. I know what you mean. It means randomly every fight has a chance of having him appear. You don't actually have to catch these guys again. Okay. I get it now. So I'll just kill them. Basically, this is my thing. I'd laugh if that one was the one that gave me rabbit. Okay. That's actually not so bad because at least I know that well done. I'm not yeah. missing anything. I mean, it's dumb, but, you know, manually select an effort, you know. I can totally manually select them when he's randomly appearing. So basically, you kind of do have to do all the side quests to get them. Funny that, eh? Oh, that ain't much damage. Well, if I could topple his stacks, it won't be that bad. Ooh, that's pretty strong for uh, just an auto attack. Jen makes fun of the how I say auto attack. Makes me cry. It don't really make me cry, but don't tell her that. Because if I say it makes me cry, it means that something probably. Oh, you made me fall. Yeah, you did, and I chose. I chose the Shiva one. But that wouldn't make a bit of a difference because all you all you get is their first form, and the only way to evolve it into their final form is to fight their final form. And if I, you like, I can't. I think now I might be able to unlock Shiva, but for the longest time, I couldn't ha unlock Shiva. So I guess the only way to get Ramu is to fight Ramu. Like I have the the baby Ramu. It's what you wanted to call Gigi. Well done. Well done. But uh, I'm not giving you Ramu just yet. Cause why would I? That one's gonna kick my ass. Fuck it, I'll do it anyway. Let's begin. Let us begin. Oh, here we go. This is Ramu. I thought we did this already. Hey guys, why isn't Ramu here with us? It's you? Ramu. Oh, hey, don't go saying Ramu's name out loud like that. Seriously. The old man is all eyes and ears. What kind of hot water are you twerps trying to get us in? And you! What were you thinking saying Ramu? Uh-oh. They summoned Ramu. Because apparently saying his name is bad. What possessed you? He looks like Sandy. At least he has the same kind of color scheme. No, look! We were giving Lon and Rain some help with their training. Nice. That is right. We're only thinking of them. You numbskulls. There's a reason we must stay in the nebula. And you know what it is. Uh, we're not dumb. The Tri-Elements Barrier, right? We have to maintain it. Come on. It's just one excursion. No, it's not. It's like two. Already your little excursion has led to two casualties. What? Don't tell me someone got out. Do you know who it is that escaped? An Ifrit and a Shiva. In both cases, you might say they were your unfairer sex. Just had to be. What? There's a female Ifrit and a male Shiva. This is going to be such a pain in the duck. Hey, you said casualties. You don't mean people. What the hell? Simple, really. 
In lieu of an elaborate summoning ritual, we can just use the magic in a human body as our gate. And as for the poor human, well, it's kind of messy. What? What, what, what do you mean, leave to fight the 55 battles? I don't get it. I'm right here. Because these two decided to goof off. Now, people have been hurt. Unless you mean like I have to go out of the Coliseum or something? Look, I don't know. Made a big mistake. A colossal mistake, you clods. <sighs> so to sum it up, another Ifrit and Shiva are on the loose and wreaking havoc here in Grimoire, right? Hmm. They may have been waiting for just this chance. If they know our Ifrit and Shiva and how responsible they always are. Well, they're just two mirages. Me and Rain can handle them. We'll find them and teach them a good. Does lesson. that mean our Ramu got That's out as right. well? Maybe. You three return to the nebula. Take care of that barrier. Very well. In that case, we will leave images of ourselves here in this place, so you may continue to train with us as before, unless you object. Uh, no. You took the words right out okay, of my Okay then. <laughs> right. I hope this is a side quest because I kind of just want to get done now. Lawn, rain, see you. Big goblins. They certainly are a handful. Bye, Gandalf. A female Ifrit and a male Shiva, right? And just when we thought we'd run out of mirages to collect. Yeah, that's. I think that's what it's supposed to be. <laughs> Yeah, it's a, it's a good game, but... Oh, they actually are here. Is that the male Shiva and the female Ifrit? Oh, I don't want them. I want the Ramu. Let's begin. I mean, it's an alright game, but... This last part here is kind of being a, a bit annoying and obnoxious right, for no real go. reason. On, it. it wouldn't be so much of a problem if they kind of just said, Okay, like, they, they don't really give you much of a clue what your hell you're supposed to go. Uh, if they had removed the star marker, then you probably wouldn't be running in the same place thinking, oh, I'm doing something wrong, but I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know. But everything else is all right. There's my lightning back. She said to use it twice, so. Yeah, I'm satisfied now. Now we have to do all the Colosseum. I got Ramu. That was easy. There we go, we got all of them. His mortal enemy is a pile of ash. Because what can he do to it if he can't reduce it to a pile of ash? Maybe he can reduce the ash to... Ashiness. What? Whoa! Time for what? Huh? Top ten scariest so jump scares in 2019. The way you're working your keeper keysters off, I figured it was time for a final battle. My bad. You're right. Let's go find Win and round up the summoners. I think that we're ready. All right, it's so the final boss it. time. Oh, dude! I am so excited. Drum roll, please. Ready to start the operation? Yeah, I'm ready. I don't have the... No, I'm not ready. Fine then. Come see me if you party poopers change your mind. I need to buy stuff. I believe it's this one. Bye. Oh no, it's Plaza 99. Oh, it was this place. Never mind. Welcome to the... Okay, we're gonna buy stuff. Right, for one, I'm gonna sell stuff actually. What am I gonna sell, you might want be asking? Probably stuff. All this useless stuff. So, this. Here we go. On. Actually, no, that one's decent. These ones are decent. So ones like that deal um, effects, those are the ones I'm kind of going to get rid of. 
I don't know what this is, so I'm going to get rid of that. What am I going to do in a world without Tama? Uh, get some well-deserved rest. Actually, I'm going to get rid of all these. I've got more than enough remedies. Let's be honest here. And I can make some decent cash from them. So I can buy better potions and stuff. I mean, it isn't exactly a lot of money, but... Yeah, we'll see. Can you buy elixirs? Probably not. I think the reason why I'm out of money is because I bought a bunch of them <laughs> and I barely even used them. Can I sell them? Because I kind of don't want them anymore. Oh yeah, there they are. Bye. I made some of my money back. How many of these can I buy? Nine. Well, you can only buy nine of them. Well, what can I say? Sell the seats. Uh, I will actually in a second. Let me see, like, if I can fit any seats on there, any of the characters that I use. That would be a bit useful to know. Probably not, but who knows. Oh, yeah, see, we actually can. What seat do we want to use? Oh, raise? No. I don't think any of the elemental ones are going to be very good, so I think we're going to use... Actually, Agility++ plus plus seems really useful. Sometimes you just need some stats. Let's upgrade Bahamut. He's a little bit low, but... I'm sure he don't mind. Oh, he almost got murdered. What would happen if I put that on? Would it work for both of them? No, actually, I think I know. This is Ramu. We are nowhere near close to finishing this character. Yeah, I'll sell the seeds once I'm done with fixing all these up. I don't even use this thing, but whatever. Whoa, I didn't mean to buy that. But I bought it anyway. Omega is done. Custom ability. What one should I put on this one? This one's more of a magic attacker, I think. Uh, we already have that now, yeah. Let's, um. Actually, I might put the strength plus on. Because they do have the berserk mode, and that's pretty, pretty strong. I like how this entire time I never found anything to evolve this. Rocky, I don't need those anymore. Don't use that. I don't really use this, but I might be able to evolve it more. Ooh. Like, how did I not have the... I don't know. I don't know how to unlock the second form of this thing. Oh, that was, I was trying to understand what you were trying to say there for a bit until you clarified you meant IRL. Honestly, that'd get really annoying, but I'd probably take it, because why the fuck not? Alright guys, let's sell all them seats. Welcome. So 
sorry seeds. These are useful, but this is the end game now. Oh, wait, can I just do this? Oh my god, I can! This is much faster. Only the bottom ones actually sold for a lot. Well, some of the other ones are good. Oh man. I don't want them to play. They'll start fucking annoying me instead. They team up. They team up and kick my cats. And by kick my cats, I mean me. Because they'll be playing with my cats. So of course they can't kick them. Or well, they might kick them. They might kick them into me so it bashes me in the face. I don't know. Okay. Should we save before we go? I feel like we should save before we go. Yeah. What? Once the Mirage Masters mans. Ma ba 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 ba. Why are you telling me this now? Uh, Why are you talking about, about this now? This, what? This, we got this ages ago. Abilities, I get to certify that mirage as a master mirage, and commemorate it by the giving you a star. Uh, okay. Thank you. You're going to want to thank me even the more in a sec. Once a mirage. Gets <laughs> Why are you telling us this? This is just. We already know this. Maybe you've already even noticed. Yes. Now yes, well, I've already noticed. Service. Wow, we'd better create as many master mirages as we can. We Look got this like sides. two or three episodes oh, ago. Hey, Tama, give me a star too. <sighs> Sorry, Lon, but I'm afraid you just aren't the what I call master material. I know. Can you imagine, Master Lon? <laughs> I mean, you're all laughing, but by technicality. Because of his age, if he like went to the doctor or whatever, like on on the list, at least over here in the UK, it would say, it would actually say Master Lan. It would actually say it. Like when I was that age, if I went to doctors, whatever, it would say the thing belonged to Master and my name. So I don't get it. Why are they laughing? It's not funny. Starting to wonder if I put Grimoire in the Where right the fuck hands. does she come from? But for now, we'll just laugh along. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's the most random thing I've ever seen in this game. You like, what? What happened? Why did they find give us that message? And then it went on forever, and then they started laughing about something that. That it doesn't even make sense. Like, why are you laughing about it when it's true? He technically is. I've been tied this too much. Uh, to be fair, that scene gets ridiculed a lot. Like, that's actually how he would laugh. But if you actually read the context of it, which I'm pretty sure most people who've played it have, I mean, he's deliberately laughing stupidly to, like, kind of make... You know, not worry or something? I don't know. Something like that. So it's not like he actually laughs like that. I mean, I, I mean, don't get me wrong. I still reference the scene stupidly like everybody else does, but... It, it isn't like that's his real laugh. Considering like two seconds after they do that, they start laughing normally. You don't have to hunt down the summoners or the League of S. I can get the word out. Good. Uh, it's a good scene, but it hurts my ears. So yeah. <laughs> oh, we're going to the crystal tour. Oh, do we have to climb this shit again? Oh my god, this it's place took for- Oh wait, no, there's a teleport. Never mind. Right. Unless they don't have to teleport anymore. Doesn't even look like crystal tower. Why is it called Crystal Tower? 
Hi Nico, how you doing? <laughs> I won't lie, Final Fantasy X is kind of eh for me, so yeah. And voice acting in the game in general, actually I can't think of a Final Fantasy which has good voice acting, so uh, yeah. Not even Final Fantasy XIV has good voice acting, in fact Final Fantasy XIV's voice acting is bloody horrible and annoying. Actually it's funny because it made me laugh during series scenes, but still. Actually, it has good voice acting, but only the bosses, because they have cool voices. Like, Sucdus must be purged. So we weren't able to stop them. That's not our objective. We're here to free the architect's souls. The Ultima Gate will have to leave it to the twins. Right. And other lines, like, Sloppy. Okay, no, Sloppy actually is kind of bad. Never mind. <laughs> Damn it, I'm trying to figure out which part you're referring to because now I kind of forgot what I kind of just said. I'm assuming you're actually meaning uh, when I said Sukdu's supposed to be purged. If that's the case, then yeah. Yeah, that is a pretty good acted. Actually, I think Final Fantasy XII has good voice acting. I can't really remember. What was with that frame rate? Is all of this? Nothing. It can't be. Yeah, no, don't. But yeah, uh, Final Fantasy ten and that's uh, thirteen. Thirteen doesn't have that bad voice acting either. I wouldn't say it has terrible voice acting. It's not like stinted or whatever. It's not like. I should have listened to that you was too chance. close. You so are I almost like a Jill sandwich. Ah, uh, gonna have to disagree with you on that one. Final Fantasy XII is one of the best Final Fantasies. Not unless you snap out of it right now. I really like Final Fantasy XII. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Mom. You know. All I ever wanted was there was a um, you kept the world safe from mirages there was uh, this person who tried to convince everybody that Final Fantasy 12 has zero percent story at all and I'm not gonna get into it much more than that but I thought that's pretty damn stupid because that's not really an opinion the opinion would be like it has a bad story, not that it has zero story at all. I mean, whether you like the story or not is a little bit different, but yeah. Yeah, the game plays itself if you make it play itself, which requires a little bit of thought. And let's be honest, most Final Fantasy battles, what do you do in most Final Fantasy battles? You just press A. It's far more... It's pretty much more efficient than just wasting items and MP and whatever. Until it comes to bosses, okay, bosses are different, but... Now, I can say... Now, I can say that if... You don't like the Gamba system, that makes sense. I can understand not liking that. I'm not gonna lie, it is a bit... Divisive. I wouldn't say that it 100% plays itself. Oh, but there is one thing I will say about Final Fantasy XII that I don't like, and I can't remember if they fixed this in the, the Zodiac version, but I'm pretty sure they did. Is that the way magic works is really fucking horrible. That you might as well just not even fucking use it. Cure, cure, just use cure. Don't even use attack magic, because it's just not worth it. Like, it cures weird, and it kind of like stops all the other magic. I can't remember exactly. Oh shit. This is uh... This is um... Bad? Um... 
Oh. Okay, yeah, it, it pretty much literally Star Wars. That no one's going to disagree with you on that one. But at the end of the day, a lot of Final Fantasies kind of take inspiration from Star Wars. So, not not to the degree Twelve does, but they all kind of do. How the fuck are you supposed to kill this guy in that time that they're giving you? He just destroyed me and... Wow. Wow. That Doom was OP. And the judge's armor looks badass. My only problem with the judges is that... Actually, I think there's only one of them. A couple of them don't really get used much. Especially the Dragoon one. I like to call her a Dragoon, but I don't even know if she uses a spear. And that scene where she dies, I'm sorry, the way that they like, I'm not the one with the dirtiest mind, but the way that they filmed that or whatever, it 100% looks like Gabranth is um, uh, kind of doing it to her, if you know what I mean. Which... We know that's not what's happening, but the way that everything looks and the noise that she makes. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but that's that's how they filmed it. It's not how I filmed it. But I wish she would get used to more. Because she's actually an alright character. And also because I wanted to see if she was actually a dragon. Whether she has a Dragoon or not, I cannot tell. Okay, we're gonna actually not use Omega here because it doesn't seem very good. Rocky. Which one of these should I use? I believe this one. Yeah, this one's just pure stat up. So let's see how it compares. Okay, yeah, no. This one's just... Okay, let's see if this is better. Roll, please. Yeah, well, I understand why 12 is a bit divisive, but I still wouldn't huh? call it a bad oh, game. Good. Then but then again, I'm the same person who actually kind of likes uh, Final Fantasy 13 as well. Although compared to like every other Final Fantasy, it's not that good. But Alright, yes, yes. Skip the cutscene. You can't skip the cutscene. Alright, there we go. Alright, see you soon then, and good luck. Um, actually, I like Lightning Returns, but, um, and I like some of 13 too, but I actually think that 13 too is my least favourite of the three. Which is kind of odd, because it's most people's actual most favourite, so, eh. It's not that I don't like it, it's just that I kind of prefer the other two. I like Final Fantasy XIII. I like it in... I like what it does to try, but I don't like the first most of it, which is a problem. Whereas Final Fantasy XIII too, I'm not really a fan of the whole monster thingy. But, um... Lightning Returns is my favourite, I think. Alright, we're gonna kick this guy's ass this time. What did he use that kicked my dick? It wasn't that. Maybe I just got unlucky. Yeah. I'm not. I'm just not a fan of the type of... I, okay, I don't want to say I'm not a fan of monster collecting type mechanics, because I love Pokemon, but... The difference between Pokemon and and Final Fantasy XIII is that you have one monster with you and two gat characters. It just it's like having a third party member, but it doesn't feel as connected or anything. I don't know. It's just how I feel. That might work if he even uses Doom, but he didn't. So. <laughs> 
Oops. I find it funny how a rock is stronger for magic than a whatever than a robot. Yeah. I don't get how a rock is stronger for magic than a robot. And I think they've scaled the health down low because you're fighting them with one party. Freezing dust, that looks so good. Okay, that was shite. Oh man, they have it easy. Oh, what do you expect? Ted's in the team. When your move that does damage actually is pointless because we do more damage back to you anyway. They don't seem to have scared her HP down. She seems to have quite a lot of it. Oh, you didn't retaliate. How dare you. Bravery. I wonder if Body Slam does more damage than just the auto attack. Brave Excess, damn, I haven't played that game in years. I forgot that it was still going, to be honest. I'm not a fan of mobile games, to be honest. I just don't feel like playing them, I suppose. I played Opera Omnia for a bit as well, but kind of grew out of that as well. But I think Brave Exodus and Oprom now are pretty good for mobile games that are free. Which is kind of saying something. And there we go. Also Record Keeper. I mean, for mobile games. They're pretty decent. But I mean, when you're contending against shit like fucking... Candy Crush and that, you know, you're not really... <laughs> got much going there. Is, is Candy Crush still a game? Never when that was like super popular. I don't know. I never played it. Thank you, son. Rorik's dead. Oh wait, I already made this joke again. Oops. Dad? Why are you saying thank Dad? you? He's the reason that you're dead in the first place. change it it's my fault all right sorry you're jen's not here because of me what do you mean you couldn't die dead he's already dead now I'm he's sorry. a ghost come on ghosties ghosties if only i kept you safe from all this instead i left you with no one at all to turn to yeah you're right because your this sister and a stupid fox bullied him through the whole bloody soul. game my very last hurrah. You see, there's nothing to feel bad about. Of course I feel bad about it! Wrong. I hate that scarf. <laughs> My son. <laughs> Makes him like, look like... What is uh, it? Yeah, and I'm a... Hipster man, I hate phones. They're too mainstream. Look at you. Don't you guys have phones? You heard. You fight for them. Patricide. Holy shit! What the heck does that mean? Hang on to that. You'll go far. It sounds cool, but I know that the word side is bad. Okay, so don't make it think that I actually think it is cool. Murder of parents. I didn't even know they had a word specifically for that, to be honest. Mom! No. Stay back. It's still... Uh... <laughs> 
Now this one looks like a dragon as well, but she never even had a spear, so it's obviously not a dragon. I'll call it a dragon though anyway, because why not? Is this the final boss? All she did was put a mask over her face and give herself a mohawk. This person should be easy because like, should be like weakened but apparently not. Damn King High Wind. Wait, that worked? I didn't think that would work, okay. Oh, I'm really low on AP. They don't re let you recharge. Wait, what the hell is the name of that thing? Helen... Helen... Helenor? Who the heck? I'm pretty sure they might have actually give you the name earlier. I don't remember it, so I'm just gonna pretend that I'm confused. It's not really a pretend when I actually am, but whatever. Would I say he's the best dragon ever? Um, he's the most iconic dragon ever. I'm the best dragon ever, I'm joking. Um, I'm not gonna lie. You're gonna hate me for saying this, but I think the best dragon ever is... And he's not even really a dragoon, but he is technically the dragoon class. And it said Highwind. He's awesome. He isn't even like a true dragoon, but I think he still counts, so I'm gonna say he's the best. Fight me if you desire, but sure. I mean, he uh, he forces you to sit down and drink your goddamn tea. I mean, can you get any better? What? You're surprised by that answer? Okay, that's not good. That is not good. See, you know, all them X potions we got? This is what they were used for. It's not that can not that weird. I mean, you can't lie, I mean, what? What has he got to counter with? He's got a counter with a Dragoon with almost no personality, Ricardo. Uh, he's got to con contend with a Dragoon who mops around a bunch and doesn't really do much else aside from that, apart from betray every other turn. Uh, Final Fantasy V doesn't really have a Dragoon. Final Fantasy VI technically doesn't have a Dragoon, although Mog could count. I'm not gonna count it because whatever. But if it did count, then I don't really like my ghost, so. And then Final Fantasy VII, he uses all the Dragoon things. And yeah. Final Fantasy VIII doesn't have a Dragoon. Final Fantasy IX has Freya, who is. Damn near the second best Dragoon, okay? He's, she's probably the second best one, she is. So, I'll give her that. The problem I have is that. Like, she kind of has a story arc and then it ends pretty early and then she just gets abandoned for like the rest of the game which is a problem pretty much all the Final Fantasy 9 characters have on the issue Ramoran and then you don't really get any arc so uh and then okay we don't even want to talk about Final Fantasy 10 because Kamari is probably the worst dragoon I hate Kamari Final Fantasy 12 doesn't really have a dragoon 13 has Fang. She's alright, I suppose. And 14 has Estenian. Estenian is feels a bit kinda like Cain for his her his story, but then once his story's done, I guess he's kinda just a traveller. Actually, he probably kinda just is Cain. Yeah, he's more blue than Dragoon, but he is still part Dragoon. He's a... Like, it's like saying that I can't call you a white mage because he's, she's more summoner than white mage. <laughs> she's both, really. 
or your happiness will spill right out. Come on. And then Farm House and then gets greedy and has a two white mage summoners. Two. It makes sense in the story, but still. Blue? Blue and Dragoon is kind of an interesting concept, but the problem is is that Kamari kind of is more of a blue mage, which is true. So his Dragooniness isn't really there. He just has a little bit of it. But you could make a blue Dragoon, but it would have to be in like Final Fantasy V or something. And it probably wouldn't even turn out that great. Damn it. I wish Adam got um, Blue Mage and then got Dragoon so he can try it out. What the hell is a Chronomancer? Actually, uh, yeah, he seems like a, he has the time magic and then he has I mean, a quick hit in that. And then he's also kind of, I don't know what you would call it, because he's not really a knight, but he's not really a thief either. He's kind of in between. Whereas, um, what's his name? Auron is like a samurai slash knight ish. It is curious you managed to defeat them. Yeah, he's Sorry. not a red mage. We couldn't stop him. Don't worry, we will. He's yeah. kind of his own type of Careful. mage, Demi. I mean, you could kind of call him a red mage if he used. But nah. But I see where you could come from that because he uses physical attacks and magic, you know, but not kind of black and white magic. So it's not a red mage. Whoa. He's got a bell behind him. Okay, are we ready to kick his ass? I'm ready to kick his ass. Excellent, Bahamut. He has no weaknesses. For some reason he can still be slowed. Riku's a thief. And probably something else. Isn't Riku the one that can use, like, the Giltos type attack? I'm pretty sure she is. Which would technically make her part samurai then, wouldn't it? Which is a funny thing to think about, because she looks nothing like a samurai. Machinist? Oh! No, no, no. Not machinist. Uh, I'd say chemist. Because she uses the mixed mechanic. I forgot about that. Uh, sorry, limit break, overdrive, whatever. What the hell is going on? We got absorbed into the black hole. That did like nothing. Uh, Waka is weird because he uses. I can't even remember his skills apart from he flings a ball. One time when I tried playing the game, I had to put. Uh, everybody down like a weird tree because I was playing the, the advanced sphere grid. Like I would make Riku go down Orin's path and Yuna go down Titus's path or something stupid like that. It was interesting and funny until I got stuck on the first Seymour fight. Yeah, she is just a black mage by me. She is a black mage. Do you even need anything more than a black mage? No, black mages are strong. R. Carmen 579. That's the name of this one. It takes forever to move off. <laughs> it doesn't even do much damage. I guess he heals himself over. She, he heals himself. Strong move. I want to use flare just because we never use it. Ooh, pretty decent damage. Banish buff. You don't really banish me anywhere. Oh, banish yet to the kitten kingdom! Imagine being banished to the kitten kingdom.
I don't think this is the final boss, to be honest. There's got to be something after this, because he's his HP's too. Low. So we probably got to get prepared. Fighter, you remember when that's a bloody class? Night slash samurai. Night slash samurai seems really really daunting, but it's true. But that's what he is. Blue slash chemist. Black mage. Blue slash dragoon. White mage slash summoner. <laughs> oh my god, you add in Seymour into this. Sage. You do realize that Sage is like red mage on steroids. It can use all the black magic and all the white magic. Well, in the NES version of Thomas 3, anyway, he is OP. In the 3D version, he's Sage is not as good. Blackout Archer and Black Mage. I mean, if I remembered what skills he had, I could maybe give him more opinion on that one. But I'm not. I don't really remember his skills aside from his ball attacks. Oh wait, yeah, he does have those different elemental balls. So yeah, I see. No, it's not wrong. It's not wrong. I just didn't even know you would include him. All right. We won. No. Yeah. Not yet. Fool. Not yet. I have hunted the worlds of A for ages, but yours was the very first in which I made true progress. I hope she just has a knife. I can now bring my rules into your world, and I happen to be exceedingly fond of my rules. Observe! You don't, do you ever get to play as him or have him in your fight? Oh yeah, that one, that one time that he's in your fight against that crab thing, scorpion thing, or whatever it's called. Do you see? Oh my god, this is the I final boss. Wow. Holy shit, he looks awesome! Oh, he can't use champions. That's alright. I wish I could actually heal before this fight, but no. Okay, this final boss probably gonna kick our ass, so let's get a little bit prepared. I hate this, I didn't sort. How much damage do they do? Not much with these physical attacks, but that's okay. Wow, that's how much damage I did with the output. You don't seem to have that much health. Pretty odd. I didn't heal because I didn't really get a chance to heal. Okay, let's see. This is going to kick my cats. Decent, I suppose. Well, that was without shell. Actually, he might not be the final boss. Who knows? How do I know? I don't know. Do you know? No, no, you don't. Except you might. I don't know. It's just turbo ether, so we can get more taxing. I mean, the arena looks cool. It reminds me of the uh, interdimensional rift from Final Fantasy V. Let's give it to them. Because they're going to full output plus. We all know how strong full output plus is. Very strong. Okay, it wasn't that strong. But I'll pretend it was so I can look cool. Both my jobs have some type of counter, which is really useful. But he is pretty fast. Yeah, 
I'm going to heal up on him after this time. Get out of here with that chicken tenders. Doesn't even make any sense in this context. And I know you why you say that trying to get under my cat. He's trying his best. Oh no, that one, that was a tough skill. And not because of its damage. Oh, that one actually was kind of scary. Let's run an expulsion. Let's age uh, We're gonna have to use remedies here. Where are the remedies? Where did the game decide to put them? <laughs> look at that difference. Yeah, remedies alone will be fine. Gonna run a uh, thunder on him. See what she does. I didn't even see what she does because I kind of looked away at the last second. But whatever. <laughs> uh, now, now he's blinded us. Okay. I hate oblivion because it locks down like all your abilities. Run out of turbo ever, but we should be able to find. Find. We should be fine. As a final boss, I don't expect him to be weak to anything specifically. Okay, we're gonna try Blizzard. Blizzard. Oh, not bad actually. Trying to okay. Wow, he glows. Gloves. Oh, I hate that move so much. It's like mega bad breath when you're confused, but you still hit the enemy. Uh oh. Okay. Okay. Let's. We. That don't sound good. We're gonna have to actually shell up. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this all in time. I think an X potion will be more useful. Here it comes. Mega Neo Omega Grand Cross Alpha Delta Sigma Alpha 2 Brutal Mode B. There was a video where somebody lagged and it was on Neo XF, so all it was. All it showed was like uh, a bunch of things going off at once and it says uh, the video was called Super Ultra Delta, I can't remember, I'll, I'll have to find it again. Mega Flare Cannon. Holy shit, why the fuck does a dragon have a cannon in this map? It's a robot Bahamut. I'm letting it go out because I want to see its charge of the animation. Because it makes it look way stronger than it probably actually is. Why did I say that? Uh oh. Oh, that was actually not that bad. That was actually not that bad. Magic counter for good measure. I feel like it just cleansed me of like oblivion. It's just like thanks, mate. I don't know if I actually did, but it felt like it did. Come on, give me a chance to stack. Okay. Chaos pulse. Oh man, that was so scary. Did you see how much damage that did to me? Hoofed. So much damage. Oh my god, yes. Yeah. Sephiroth's big attack number. His worst attack was turning into a fucking frog. That was his worst attack. Because when he turns you into a frog, you can actually get died. 
get died. I mean, you can actually die. Of course, that's assuming that you actually let them live long enough to actually get that attack off. Holy Jesus. Holy Jesus. This is... Uh, this is bad. I'm just going to use an elixir because I'm scared. Is that move that does something, probably. Okay, we're good. We're good. That was actually pretty scary, I'm not going to lie. Bad RNG, maybe, but scary, truly. He's almost dead. Okay, that move is shit. He keeps missing with it. That move is not shit. That's his strongest bloody move. I'm not gonna lie. Imagine dying by an auto attack that was from a person you confused. That would have been funny. There we go, he's dead. Uh, we'll see if there's a second phase. Whoa. There we go. He is dead. No more Tama. Yeah, no more Tama. Unless there's a second phase, then there might be a little bit more Tama. But still. Also, what the hell is that emote? A laddie no. cry. Is it done yet? Almost. Just a little more time. Really? Is that all? He's immortal. Can't kill him. Oh, he's gonna freeze himself again. This is exactly the whole point why we went and did all this. Why didn't we do that in the first place? Polly. Yeah, why didn't we do that in the first place? Oh, because he can get out. Come on! We're not going to make it. Lady Luz, help us. His wings are outside it. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> that was kind of weird. Also, if he can get out of this one, how could he not get out of the other one when he throws both of them together? Don't let Lon's power overtake him. Keep control. Mom? You'll be okay. Imagine they did what they did in Final Fantasy XIV and actually touched the cage to give it their power. That's probably Final Fantasy XIV's dumbest moment, in my opinion. Yeah! When Ice Heart and Horse of Folk came and actually touched the eye to bring it out. Like, what? It doesn't make sense. That never happens anywhere else. Seems to. I don't know. To. I don't like it. It didn't make sense. It never happens ever in any other context. It only ever happened there and conveniently only happened for them to bring. And it goes too cliche and cheesy and ugh, I don't like it. Everything else the part was fine. It was just that part that Ice Heart and Horsebot came back temporarily for like no reason. Well, they had a reason what they were doing. But it didn't make sense how they came back, and then they just go away as fast as they came. Alright, but I don't think that really has any bearing on what happened in that scene, to be honest. I think it's completely unrelated. How were they getting sucked in if it was only supposed to bring the Cogna back? Hmm? 
cock da. Mm. Rose of the cat. Looks like a jet in here. Don't say it. Thank you. I don't want it to say key. Should they not have released the cage so that the guy would get sucked out in as well? He's got six wings. Oh no, it's bringing the box with him. <laughs> I suppose that makes sense. If you bring the box with it, then never mind. The box broke. The box broke that easily. Uh oh. He no go in fast. He no go alone. Fuck off. This, like, ten-year-old kid just fucking kicked a big giant-ass knight and actually made him move. Really? Oh no, they're monks. They have the uber power. Whoa. Okay, it makes sense in that, that scenario, because he has that big arm. <laughs> What are you talking about, Olivia? I'm staying about stupid shit. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't understand it, but I will assume it was a typo. With a kick. I mean, I gotta talk about something, right? <laughs> there! Use those to keep Grimoire safe. You'll find all the other Prismariums with Seraphie. Oh, we can't do the end what? game because we what won't be there. What are you saying? The Dyad has done enough damage. It's time for us to leave for good. <sighs> you can't. I don't. Everything's going to be better, Wynn. Once we go through, the portal will vanish. So these traps. Speaking of kicking, there's been some funny film as of Teen Drama yesterday. I probably you? won't go too much into it, at least Get not on stream, but you don't want your it was funny. <laughs> all you need to do is go to the shitpost reddit, <laughs> and it's right near the top. That's all you need to do. If you really care. Tama! Take care of Wynn and Grimoire for us once we're gone! What do you say? And thank you for everything! I mean, yeah, you should only heal. Why Why would you holy Aero and heal the tank who's not using cooldowns? Why would you do that? That's fucking stupid. Get, get your ass out of this fucking raid. It was a dungeon, but get that out of the raid anyway. All these characters. Like Terra, who we never really interacted with apart from like one fight. Tama has such a faceless face, emotionless face, because she's in a wolf form. Don't know why she stayed in a wolf form. She probably should have went into a normal form there. Yeah, maybe. Well, I understand practically, but at the end when she had already saved everyone, like she could have done it. She just proved she could have just changed. <laughs> she didn't even say bye, <laughs> like love her voice. They brought us so much bad and good, and then they just swept it all away in the end. I'll say, the two of them were a force of nature. Maybe I'll take a leaf out of their playbook, and go a little crazy for a change! For a change? Oh, please. Your current crazy level
levels are hard enough on us. Well, at least Rain and Lon seem like they're gonna be okay. Isn't yes. this like the first time Titus and Aiko have actually like we have nothing to worry about. <laughs> okay. It's our turn. Grimoire's gonna need some fixing up. It's gonna be a lot of work. That's it. Well, see ya. Oh, see ya. Why'd you get a last word? Thanks, you two. You can rest now. Yeah, well, thanks then. for coming into my cafe, eating all my sugars, making me go to a different world, and causing all the deaths and tamanization. Like, oh, what a day that was. All I wanted to do was just work in the cafe, and I ended up going to save a fucking world. Crazy, eh? I'll use Squall's gun. Actually, I might not use Squall's gun, but because that uh, Alexander one might look cool. Holy shit, this is too hyper realistic for me. Anyway, I don't know why I said you're going to be that GMD. That's like 90% of all the gun breakers on launch. They're all going to be that. Which is why I'm not going to be <laughs> I don't like using the clothes. It's too like, I don't know. Stop my thing. Hammer's JP voice. I wouldn't be able to tell the difference. Honestly, I kind of mistook the rain there for Sarah from Valor's 13 for a second. Oh, that's too uncanny. That's creeping me out. Shut up, you're ruining the moment, Melly. <laughs> she bought Chivalry. Oh my god, look at the G those other names. Why don't I say. Oh, never mind, those aren't different names. Those were like probably the male Shiva and then female Ifrit. Okay, it feels weird seeing. Oh my god, I can't look at that! Oh, like the other characters, I suppose, but Squall and Cloud dancing? Oh. Ah, why? And Warrior of Light! Honestly, it doesn't surprise me to see Shekel, just because I don't know the character. Oh my god. That was so weird, watching Squall dance. Oh, well welcome back, Jenyan. Yeah, you missed the end, but you can watch it on YouTube at... Um, www.something something something youtube.com slash something something I don't know fuck it it's in the description down below you know where to find it but it won't be uploaded for another 24 hours because I'm not allowed to upload it for another 24 hours because that's what you do when you be an affiliate so ba -ba 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 -ba. that was worst I don't and that's the worst thing in this entire game which actually says a lot because if the worst thing is watching scroll dance for five seconds is the game isn't that bad. You know what I mean? Like, I didn't pay attention to Cloud, but I bet you it was just as bad. They're just not the type of characters you would expect to see dancing in that manner. I mean, I know Squall has danced before, but it was a different type of dance. Well, I suppose I'm supposed to get my wish now? Oh <laughs> okay, yeah, don't zoom in on Cloud or Squall. Even though I can see Squall in like every scene. Okay. 
this game is so weird. Actually, it's, the warrior of light I don't see it isn't that bad. It's only Cloud and Scorn. Honestly, I could see Titus doing this shit. I'm not gonna lie. Actually, Celeste I couldn't see doing this either. But that's because she's like a more reserved type person. And Terra, she's more reserved as well. Oh, and like, you know what? Most of these characters wouldn't do this, okay? So, you know what? Who cares? Who cares? Really? She's shy and everything. I don't see her being that hyperactive type of person. Why did she not get to dance? Raphael would do that. Probably. And why, what about Ferris? She wouldn't do it. She damn near didn't want to show that she was a male. A female. Bart's, yeah I can see Bart's doing that dance. Aiko. Yeah I can see Aiko doing that dance if it impressed the Dane. Vivi. No, no I couldn't see Vivi doing it. Rika, yeah I can see Rika doing that for sure. More than any other character ever. <laughs> You know, yes, it pains me to say it, but yes, I could see her doing it after Final Fantasy X too, but not in Final Fantasy X. Chocolina, yeah, I could see her doing it. Vivi did tell the well, that's different Vivi. Princess Cornelia, I don't really know her. She's not got much of a character. Redia, I could see her maybe doing it, but it would probably... I don't know. And fuck it, Gilgamesh. Yeah, Gilgamesh, you can dance. You're Gilgamesh. You can do whatever you want. I don't know much about you. Edgar. He'd fucking do anything if a girl he liked was doing it. So, yeah. Uh, Guy. I don't know your life, so I will say you will do it. Tifa. Well, they did use the kind of upbeat type of Tifa, so maybe. I mean, she has the cowboy hat and all. I've, I don't play Final Fantasy Dissidia, or whatever it's called, so... It honestly, Snow's that type of asshole goofball that probably would do that shit. Quist this. Ah, didn't you see her doing a wee dance? Didn't you see her doing it? Ah! Get away! <laughs> you can't see it right now, but I'm hiding my face. Ah... <laughs> uh. Oh, and that's not fair, she gets to be seen twice. <laughs> Bloody Sid. I hate Sid. This one time, I was walking down the street, and Sid just came and drop kicked my wife. <laughs> She was in hospital for two seconds. Uh, yeah, sure, I'll save it. That was about a 40 hour RPG. Pretty good. Pretty good. And you know what is hilarious is that we actually finished it pretty much on time of when the stream usually ends anyway, so now I don't have to end it early, I don't have to end it late. That is great. But we'll see if there's something else to do first. World of Final Fantasy, Koopa. Yeah, Koopa. Nah, I don't think there's anything. And you know what? That's all okay. So guys, with that done, I think that brings us to the end of the stream here. Uh, thank you all for watching. That was a good ending, I suppose. Uh, that means that we're all done. And so, therefore, actually, I've already told you that I have to finish this game tomorrow. Albeit, it shouldn't take four hours to beat this game, especially where I am. So, I have to do it. I have to do it. Can't just leave it unfinished. And then if I have spare time, then fuck it, meta relax. And also, 
a special thank you to Aluria because he actually bought the game for me so there's the extra special thank you I'm, I don't really know how else to do it aside from say it but I'm sure you all know what I mean so I'd say visit his channel but he doesn't stream apart from I think he did it one time but if you want to do visit his channel because he might stream at some point who knows I don't know do it anyway but also thank you Aluria because it was a good game and you didn't have to buy it especially uh, but you did so thank you and yes so well I think I'm just gonna end it now so have a good day or night and I'll see you tomorrow and make sure you're prepared for Shadowbangers if you're playing that game if you're not playing that game then you don't have to get prepared for it and also Remember to eat oranges. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Unless something stupid happens. But it shouldn't. So, goodbye. Jesus, that was the longest one did I have ever done. Meow. <laughs>